Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and welcome back to another ex and yet another episode of The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Um, previously, what we did is we uh, got some items. We got the Tinkle Tuner and the Picto Box. I took some pictures with the Picto Box, as seen here. What the Tingle Tuner allows you to do is it allows you to call Tingle from and get help. But it's not free. You gotta give him money. Now what we did also at the very at the very end of the previous episode, we talked to the teacher in there. And now and now and then she asked us to um, talk to the leader of the killer bees. Yeah! Yo, bud, you got a problem with us killer bees, huh, do you? Don't tell me this is... That it's your teacher, the teacher again, is it? You came here to give us a talking to because Mrs. Murray asked you to, right? Tell us not to skip school, right? Bud, tell us not to be late, right, bud? Well, forget about all that. We're the mighty and invincible gang of four. The killer bees. Do you think that we would listen to somebody like you? But I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then we'll think about listening a little bit. What do you say, bud? Do you want to challenge us? I'll take you on. Okay, your funeral, bud. The rules are simple, bud. We're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you... Ooh, humble bundle. We're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you find us, you we're gonna run. You gotta try and catch us. Easy as that, bud. We won't hide indoors or nothing, and we won't leave this island. So look for us ar ar around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. If you catch all four of us, we lose. You got it, bud? Ready, bud? Go, bud! And what happens is this is pretty much a game of hide-and-seek. And, um... These, um... The members of the killer bees will actually, like, run around, and it's kind of tough to find them. But I'm gonna speed this part up until I do find them. Hey Mario, what's up? Hey there, boy. Oh, what did did you uh, see? What happened? Did, did you see the poster box uh, near the docks? Uh, well, uh, just uh, so you know, if you want to send uh, someone a letter, just to uh, send it to Y Z or X uh, and use uh, that uh, button to put it in the poster box. Uh, it's just uh, that easy. Before long, uh, the, the Rito postman uh, will come to deliver it to uh, whoever you've sent it to. Uh, here's a, he's a harder working fellow, I tell you. Wahoo! Well, he's not really Mario, but he looks like Mario, so he might as well be called Mario. I mean, there's enough Mario crossovers in Zelda games, so I'm pretty sure that's what they were going for. I think the first one is over that way. No. Nope. I will find them and then be back here. Oh, it's over here, actually. The first character is over here. Oops. Oh, here's the first one. Oh, the cutscene stopped me. Then he runs over that away. I've got to. Whoa! Get off the vine link. 
There. Oops. Now we have to go over here. There we go. Gotcha. Ah, lame. Oh, there's actually there's actually somebody in this tree right here. No, I don't want to talk to you. No. Basically, he's talking about how his. No, I don't want to keep talking to you. Sorry. But what he basically says is that his daughter is trapped at the Forsaken Fortress. So here's the leader of the killer bees. Gang. Quote, quote. <laughs> gotcha. Yer, you got me. Oh, it was a red ru or yellow rupee. That was a lot of money. Well, not a lot of money, but some. I've never talked to this character. Yep, to sailors like us, the winds our whole life. It'd sure be nice if a fair wind blew today. Is there anything up here of, of note? Oh, there's somebody down there. Um, let me see. Oh, 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 that was close. There's somebody right here. Oh. I'm gonna try to sneak on by oh no I don't want to talk no you're awesome Okay, one left. I think. Oh, I remember what's out here. It's actually the other killer bee. Well, hi. I think he's actually the slowest one. Just based on this cutscene alone, he seems to be kind of slower. Well, maybe not. Whoa, that's pretty far away. Yeah, you got me. There we go. We've got all four of them. Arg! I can't believe it. You found all four of us. And you cut us all too. Talk about other defeat. Looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess it's time that we chilled out. From now on, we won't cause no trouble for anyone. And to reward your hide and seek and skills, here, take this, bud. You got a piece of heart. Wonderful. Now we need only two more pieces of heart to complete a. Heart container. And then we would have four pieces of heart. Or no, I mean four four hearts of health. Ugh, this is our favorite possession. But you've proven that you're worthy. To our bud, the hide and seek master. Oh, and one more thing, we need you to apologize to Miss Murray Mrs. Murray for us, alright? We're counting on you, bud. So I helped you out with what you wanted. Uh, we need to talk. 
You did it, didn't you? You said something to those delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? You can't fool me. I watched it all from the shadow of my door. You really are, dear. You fill me with joy. I have to reward you, so th here's a little spare change. Ah! A purple rupee. And I'm, uh, I already have 200. Ah! Oh, and one more thing. Don't tell anybody. Dear. Can we talk again? Um. Oh, okay. Well, I think we have to talk to the kids again. Oh. Hey, sounds like you apologized to the teacher for us. Good old Mrs. Murray. And speaking of Bud, did you know that it's going to be Mrs. Murray's birthday soon? Boss! Oh, boss! You think we should give her some kind of present or something? Don't be stupid. We're the killer bees. We ain't no teacher's pets. Well, they aren't a teacher's pet if they use the word ain't, which isn't a word. Uh. Yeah, but teacher loves jewelry and stuff more than anything else in the world. What's she into these days? What'd she call them? Joy pendants? Really? Where do you find them? Are they just lying around? If we could just find some, we could give them to teacher as a present. And she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly light up at the top of some tree in town. Where was that? Maybe, maybe there's one of them pendants. What do you think, boss? Nah, that's crazy talk. Uh, well... They, they're not wrong because if we if we find that particular tree might be this one nope There we go. There's the joy pendant. Link automatically grabs it. You got a joy pendant. You can keep it in your spoils bag. Okay. Well, I mean, I already have one, so... This is just a free joy pendant. Yo, bud. Looks like you found yourself a joy pendant. Solid work. Actually, I gotta admit, we hid that thing up in the trees. We thought you might find it. Listen up. It's gonna be Mrs. Murray's birthday soon. We were thinking of giving her a present, so it was good that we finally got our hands on that thing. But we can't be going around giving presents to people. No way, that just doesn't fit the Killer Bee's style. Come on, bud. Can you, can't you give it to the teacher for us? Can't you? And it's not like we could... I don't know who's talking. It's not like we could just ask anybody to do it for us, neither. It's got to be somebody reliable who can keep a secret. You're the only one we could ask, but Oh, it's probably the leader of the killer bees. Thanks for not giving talking mouth animations, Nintendo. Or maybe they were talking in unison, I don't know. But we got to go back to the teacher and give that joy pendant to her. That we got for free. Whoa, they're already back here, huh? Oh, here's the... Here's the, uh, schoolhouse. It rocks. Well, when we go up to the teacher, we actually have to hand her a joy pendant. Lock on and press button that you locked it to. My dear, that's a joy pendant. To tell you the truth, I love jewelry above all else. And that, why, that is extremely rare and hard to come by. It's the hottest thing around, dear. Oh my, yes, I will happily take a single one for you. No, no, I insist, only one. To tell you the truth, I'd actually like about 20 of them. 
but that would probably only happen in the wildest of dreams. You know, I've been a teacher here for a long time. It's tough to put one past me. That being said, I'm pretty sure I know who put you up to this, dear. Those little sweeties. I'm so joyful. It's the best birthday present I could ask for. I suppose I ought to thank you. Close your eyes, dear. It better not be a rupee again. Oh, okay. Well, just a red rupee. That's fine. Just 20. That I wasted again. And if you see those boys again, tell them I said hello. Or say hello. Uh, I'm confused about what that said. Ugh. I'm gonna actually go talk to them, see what they say. Yeah! You're the coolest, bud! Okay. Blue rupee in that pot right there. Nope. And I know I'm cutting it a little short today, but it's kind of the best place to stop because that way I can um, continue on with um, the rest of Windfall Island. I can continue on with the rest of Windfall Island, what I can do now. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll do that in the next episode. Um, next time, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna go get, this, go get the sale, and then go around town to get anything else. Actually, I should probably wait because I don't wanna get more rupees that I can't use. Uh, so I'm gonna do that next time. Goodbye for now.